Hi everybody and welcome to True Once, where here we try to help you make that decision if it's going to change from a want to a need. If you are new to my channel, I really hope you will choose to subscribe. It's free and it's easy. It's the red button that you'll see right underneath this video. If you press it and it turns gray, you're in. It's that simple. There's also a bell beside that subscribe button that I always recommend that you press. It's called the notification bell. And what ends up happening is YouTube will notify you just once that I have uploaded a brand new video. I do upload a lot and sometimes my videos are time sensitive so I don't want you to miss out. So make sure to press that subscribe button, ring that bell and you'll be in the know. Also right underneath the video there is that thumbs up. That's important for the growth of a YouTuber. So if you're enjoying that I'm making content, please take a second to hit that thumbs up. It will turn blue, the number will increase and that's you helping True Ones get noticed on the YouTube platform. Please note that the information that I'm going to be giving you is not to be used during the thumbs up or thumbs down. If you are disappointed in the news that I have to deliver that I received an email from BoxyCharm, I want to make sure that you guys leave that information in the comments and the thumbs up is that I'm able to share the news with you through video. All right. Okay. Let's get started. I did try to take a picture of the information that came down via email. However, it is not that clear on the screen, so I'm going to read to you the information that I got via email. And then we're going to end off this video on a positive because the charm room is now open and there's some fantastic ones that I want to go through with you that I think are absolute winners. And I did place my charm room order prior to setting all this up. And then this email came down. So I decided to put them all within the same video. All right. Starting with the information at hand, the newest news at BoxyCharm is that they sent an email about a price increase in reference to the base box. What they wrote is, at BoxyCharm, we have always promised to give you the best in beauty by delivering full-size beauty items from brands you love at unbeatable value directly to your door each month. For us to keep that promise, we will be changing the price of the base box to $27.99 a month starting January 1st of 2022 with your January box. We will continue to curate five of the hottest beauty products from brands like Anastasia Le Beverly Hills, Pharmacy, Saturday Skin, and Ofra with an average retail value of $175, which is the same as it was before. Every month, that's five products for the price of one. Plus, you will still have access to their monthly drop shop and mega drop shop online stores with even hotter discounts at up to 80% off the retail. If you want to lock in the price, they're saying it is $25 that you can lock in as long as you sign up for a 12 month plan to guarantee this special rate. Just to make sure that you guys know that if you do that, you are paying for a full year ahead of time for this box. You always ask me what I do. When I initially started with BoxyCharm, I was on the yearly as well as with Ipsy. But as I'm getting more and more boxes on my channel that I pay for, I've decided to do it month to month. That is how I'm comfortable. So that is, I'm choosing not currently now to lock it in. However, if I was only getting the BoxyCharm base box, I think it is a fantastic deal to lock in. But however, the difference is only the difference of $3 a month, but it is still free ship in the USA. And with that said, I also want to use this video to share a little bit of information in reference to the Mega Drop Shop. When I placed my last order with Mega Drop Shop, I was still under over the $25 where I received free freight. However, the free shipping now had another fee that they charged $1.99, which they're calling the shipping and handling fee. So they're trying every which way to try to keep the prices down. But based on what's happening in the world with, you know, shipping and everything else, all these prices are going up. So all of a sudden we started to see a shipping and handling fee on the mega drop orders. I also received a, a a, a comment from one of my subscribers that they placed an order on Ipsy and on their order on Ipsy it was free shipping but they were charged a dollar 49 handling fee so watch your invoices look and make sure because there's these little 
increases that are popping up in different areas. So I just want to make sure that you guys are aware of it. And to finalize what they wrote in the email, it says increasing prices even a little is never fun. We take it very seriously like many companies. BoxyCharm has really felt the impact of the in, sorry of the current economic environment on manufacturing and supply chain. They are seeing increased costs across the board, including material sourcing challenges, fluctuating shipping costs, and labor shortages. Ultimately, they had to update their pricing, so they will continue to deliver something fabulous, so we know you will love that and can be proud of. We want to thank you for being part of the Vibrant community and inspiring us each day. I also want to go through the charm room with you guys really quickly, but just to close this off in reference to the news in the boxy charm increase, this is only happening January 1st, so you have time to think about it and decide if you want to lock in for the full year where you could lock it in at that $25 base price. I will still have both boxes on my channel. I have two accounts, as you know. So for me, it's a double whammy because I'm, you know, paying on two accounts for four boxes, you know, two base, two premium, and then when the Lux month comes. So for me, you know, it hits me at $6, you know, each a month just on the base box alone. So the price increases on everything are really hitting home. So you really have to sit down and figure out based on these increases, which boxes you wanna keep, which boxes are the deals that you want. To me, the base box on BoxyCharm is a no brainer. This is a brand that I have enjoyed since day one. I have never skipped a month. And then they've only added features that I'm really enjoying as well, like the customization choices, which for me more than pay for the box, as well as the drop shop and mega drop shops. So. That's my point of view in reference to it. I wanna make sure that you guys share yours. All right, the charm room, like I said, is now open. It is November 30th. What's really exciting about the charm room is there's some items in here that I was excited to have the opportunity to try. If you're not familiar with charms, charms is for reviews. When you do rev reviews, you get charms and then your charms in turn into dollars. Everything in the charm room ships for free. There was no shipping and handling or anything on my charm room order. All that I ended up paying was the taxes. If you don't have enough charms, they can deduct the amount of charms that you have and then you pay the difference in the credit card charge. So that's the only differences that you have to know that if you do not have enough char charms to cover it, you pay the difference and that gets charged to your credit card. But if you have enough charms, all that you will be charged are the taxes. So the first item here is from Dalton Beauty. This is a brand that I'm very familiar with through the shopping channel circuit. She uh, had her line on QVC for many years under her name Dalton, D-A-L-T-O-N. Then she went into Europe and she had to change the name of the company to Dal10. And I think it's actually a cuter name. Her products are really good. They're very much geared to, uh, you know, I feel middle age and up. Uh, I love everything that she does and what she represents, and I've never had the opportunity to try this product of hers, so I grabbed it because I did have the charms in one of my accounts. Then from Amika, this is another brand that is a fantastic, fantastic brand that I'm happy to start seeing it on BoxyCharm. It's one that I highly recommend as well. Tan Lux is a brand that is new to me, but it's a brand that the reviews online are very, very strong uh, on this brand worldwide. Then we have from Daily Concepts, which is a really good brand. That is their mini scrubbers. There's going to be a five pack in that one. Then we have from Tarte. This is the Tartiest Quick Dry Matte Lip Paint. This really stays on the lips. It is beautiful. And the color that's available is the one color that's there. Milk Makeup, their Long Wear Gel Eyeliner is also a fantastic product. The only color that they're showing here is in the color navy. Glamier, these are really cute brushes to give as gifts. It does come in that plastic bag as well. And then from Grown Alchemist, this is a brand that I really highly recommend. This actually, I just received and chose it in my FabFitFun box. If you didn't see that unboxing of my FabFitFun, that is one that I ended up choosing uh, from this brand. And it is one that I've already used up completely to the end, which means I really enjoyed it. And that you are all in the same uh, scent, which is this mandarin and rosemary leaf. Then they have this brand called Cara Therapy. I'm not familiar with it at all, but Milk Makeup. This is the Kush Fiber Brow Gel. It is in that dark shade. So if that shade is good for your brows, then choose that one. 
Then we have from Keja. They're showing three shades here, but the other two are completely X'd out. So the only color available is that dark, dark burgundy. Then from Bliss, they have the Green Tea Wonder Overnight Gel Mask. Please share in the comments if you've had the opportunity to try this because I do enjoy the Bliss line and $15 is very reasonable, but I've never tried this and I have so much skincare right now that I didn't pick this up, but I would love to know if you have and what your feelings were about it and your skin type. If you can share that in the comments down below, much appreciated. Then we have from Ona, this New York, uh, these eye gels. It says there's a pack of five. Then from OPV Beauty, I've seen a few girls unbox something else from this brand, their eyeshadows, and they said it was a really good brand. And this, if you're interested in rainbow colors, this is their rainbow splash palette. Then from Daily Comsets, this is their Daily Beauty headband. And then from Too Faced, they have the Rich and Dazzling Lip Gloss. This gloss from the Rich and Dazzling line has a real shimmer to it. There's almost like little, you don't feel it on your lips, uh, like sparkles, that it, it really glistens when you put on this lip gloss. Then we have here from Too Faced. I was keeping my fingers crossed on this one, but the shades that are in here are either really, really fair or very dark. So if this is these shades, any of them meet your, your criteria, this is one that I highly, highly recommend. Too Faced is, is a full, full coverage concealer and is one that I reach for daily. It is fantastic. Then we have from Coors, the Greek Yogurt Calming Cooling Gel. I have not tried their cooling gel from their Greek yogurt line, but I have tried their cleanser and I do recommend. The Coors Elastic Smooth Body Butter, I picked this up because every time I see a Coors Body Butter in here, I grab it. And then from a Too Faced Hangover Primer, if I didn't have a, a backup of a backup of this one, this would have also ended up in my cart because the Too Faced Hangover Primer is a very hydrating uh, primer and it is one of a, a, a fantastic, fantastic primer, be it if you are a combo like me or you are a dry skin girl. It is one that I highly recommend. Then I got very excited that Fenty Beauty, they had some Pro Filter Soft Matte Long Wear Foundation, got introduced to this foundation through BoxyCharm, and it is now my number one pick for foundation. For a combo girl, it is fan fantastic. The color that I normally get, the shade that I get was not available, but there was a shade down from it. I went on Fenty's website to see the close match. I think it'll be good enough. So I chose one of these also that is gonna show up in my charm room order. So please check the uh, shades. There's more than uh, 10. I think there were 13 shades available when uh, the charm room opened. Hopefully, fingers crossed, if you're interested in this foundation, that your shade is available as well. And then they have from Fox Bay a Foxy Paddle Brush in Rose Gold. And that's all the news that I have for you guys today. Like I said, please share in the comments. That's my lifeline to you guys. I'd love to know your thoughts and your feelings on this. Otherwise, it's just me sharing my thoughts and feelings. I love being able to share the news with you, but I also love your feedback as well in the comments down below. If you enjoy that I take the time to do these videos, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you all soon in my next video. Take care, everybody. Stay well.